Okay, I'm gonna walk through steps 41 through 50 of Free Code Camp's new responsive web design second project, learn basic CSS by building a cafe menu. Okay, so um, we have, we just, um, in the last step, we just um, made the widths of each of these, the flavor and the price to 49. So 49 plus 49 does not equal 100. And so that's why we have this equal space of, it's 2% right here. Um, and it's, it doesn't look, we want it to be 50 and 50. And so what we're going to do, the first step is we're just going to put um, both paragraph tags on the last, um, we're going to put them on the same line and then we're just change this back to 50. And so we're not going to have that weird issue again because they're, um, both paragraph tags are on the same line. So now they're both on the edges. Okay. Um, so now what we're going to do is we're going to start to make all of the rest of the items on the menu that are for coffee or coffee items. Um, we're going to make them look just like um, this French vanilla one. So the first thing we're going to do is just add class equals item to every article. That, um, and remember attributes just go to the opening tag. Okay, so it's starting to look a little bit more similar. Next, um, we're gonna put both paragraphs on the same line. So, um, yeah, so we're, soon we're gonna add the classes to both paragraphs. And that's what we're, exactly what we're gonna do right now. So for the first one, ah, flavor. And the second one is the price. And you can start to see how everything is starting to look like the French vanilla one, which is exactly what we want. Oops. There we go. So the next thing we're gonna find out is, you can't see it right now, but if we're on a smaller device, such as a phone, as you start to move this closer, oh, look at that caramel macchiato. It's on two lines now. Instead of you make it a little wider, it's on one. You make it a little closer, it's two. And everything on the left starts to make two, but look, we still have space here. So the way we're gonna fix that is we're gonna give each, the flavor, 75% of the room, and we're gonna give the price 25%, right? Because the dollar amount is very small. So now look, we're on a much smaller, we can be on a smaller screen and uh, they all stay on the same line. So once, now it gets to the, pretty much to the point where when the O for Macchiato almost hits the three and 375, then it goes to the next line. Um, but I don't really think there's any uh, phones that are, I mean, this is really, really, really thin. So it should be fine for most people if not all. So the next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna add a new section, right? So we're gonna go find that end of the closing section tag and just add a new one. I'm gonna make sure I have correct indentation and we're gonna to go to the next element. So now we're gonna add some desserts to the menu. There we go. All right, so we're gonna do a similar thing to last time we're gonna add article tags. And we're gonna add the class equals item. Because we want the paragraphs to be displayed the same way as this. So next all we're gonna do is add some paragraph tags. So I have two paragraph tags right here. The first one is this and this or, well, that's the second one actually, and here's the first one. And so the first one is just gonna say donut, and we're going to put um, $1.50 for the second one. Okay, 